Hello students, today let's talk about thyroid gland which is the largest endocrine gland of our body. Now this is present in the neck region and we see that there are two oval elongated lobes connected by a isthmus. Now inside the thyroid gland we see that there are two types of cells called the follicular cells and parafollicular cells. Follicular cells are lined by cuboidal epithelium and in the center they have a semi-fluid material present called the colloid. Now follicular cells are responsible to release the two major hormones of thyroid gland T3 and T4. T3 is triiodothyronine and T4 is tetraiodothyronine or nothing but thyroxine. We see that T3 is more active and potent but it is released in less concentration when compared to T4. So we see there's conversion of T4 into T3 near the active cells of the body. We have another type of cell present in the thyroid gland called the parafollicular cells which is responsible to release a hormone called calcitonin. Calcitonin plays a very important role in calcium homeostasis and it is usually hypocalcemic and hypophosphatemic in nature and we need to remember that it has an antagonistic effect to the parathyroid hormone released by the parathyroid gland. One unique function of thyroid gland is it will store its secretion in the semi-fluid material of the follicular cells and whenever it is required it is released into the blood. Hence we've understood thyroid gland. Make your concept stronger and stay ahead in your learning journey. Join me and other subject experts on the Turito app for daily free concept classes. Download the app now.